from today's TMJ4. This is breaking news now. I've been carrying something around with me for a year. And it's Layla. And I'd like to think we could put her to rest now. Breaking news now this noon hour, nearly a year after she was murdered, Layla Peterson's accused killers have now been caught. And good afternoon once again, everyone. I'm Vince Vetrano. And I'm Bridget Shanahan. It's been almost a year since five-year-old Layla Peterson was shot and killed while sitting on her grandfather's lap in his living room. An emotional news conference this morning announcing the arrest of three men in connection with her death. Yona Gavino is live now for us in Milwaukee. Yona. Bridget, we finally got the news that Layla Peterson's family has been hoping, waiting and praying for justice. It came after nearly a year of waiting. Right now, let's go to video and show you that press conference that just wrapped up moments ago. Now, Milwaukee police announcing the arrest and charges against three suspects. They ended up shooting the wrong house they intended to shoot. Police say cracking the case took so long because no one was coming forward with information. Chief Lynn got very emotional as well. He pulled out a picture of Layla he'd been carrying around in his pocket for nearly a year. Well, information that we've received from many sources, as well as the investigation of the detectives themselves, has resulted in the arrests of three individuals in the death of Layla Peterson. Paul Farr has been charged with two counts of harboring and aiding a felon. Carl Barrett and Arliss Gordon are each charged with first degree reckless homicide. And afterwards, you know, the family really didn't feel comfortable staying and, and answering questions, talking to the media. But during that press conference, her father did speak and told all of us that he finally got his first peaceful night's rest in nearly a whole year. We're live here outside of District 7. Yona Gavino, today's TMJ4. All right, Yona, thank you. A couple minutes after.